Well, tornado survivors and first responders were treated to hot barbecue lunches today. Yeah, the Salvation Army volunteers took the food to rural areas surrounding Blair and Bennington. KATV News Watch 7's Sean McKinnon reports on the effort that's helping those who've lost pretty much everything. Just south of Blair, dozens of volunteers get to work, packing up 300 pounds of pork loin and the fixins. Hundreds of meals for those who need it most. Longtime volunteer Margie Smith couldn't believe the destruction the tornadoes left. We're kind of used to inclement weather this time of year, but nothing like this. Nothing like this. So she's doing what she always does. When you see something like this happen, you cry and then you say, OK, let's go help them. The meals were loaded into Salvation Army trucks and hit the country roads, then dropped off at homes like Brian Prokop's. Words can't describe the, the thank you I can give everyone right now. The tornado wiped out their home, snapped trees, and tossed military-grade containers weighing thousands of pounds across a field. There are two more they can't even find. The destruction was unfathomable. I came up over the hill. And my heart just, it sank for her dad, 30 years, he, everything gone, you know. A farmer named Dale completely lost his home and barn. He tells volunteers farmers are proud people, accepting only a hug and some food. I'm not one to ask for help. The people from here in Bennington basically said, you have no, you have no choice for help. You're getting help. You're, you're, you're your life has been destroyed. We're helping you. Because I'm a human being. I've been I've been through a lot of trauma in my life and there have been people there for me. How can I not pay it forward? 